Yuri Vips was arguably next in line for a shot at Red Bull Racing and Alpha Tauri, but now his place in motorsport altogether looks in serious doubt. Vips has been suspended by Red Bull for using offensive and racist language while streaming Warzone with his fellow Red Bull junior Liam Lawson. We're going to look at the implications that this could have. But before we go any further, GP Blog of course completely condemned the use of any racist, homophobic or discriminatory language in any setting and it will not be tolerated across our platforms. In their statement, Red Bull Racing said, we condemn abuse of any kind and have a zero tolerance policy to racist language or behavior within our organization. In response, Vips released a statement admitting what he said was unacceptable, adding, I deeply regret my actions and this is not the example I wish to set. I will cooperate with the investigation fully. So what could happen next? The Estonian has been suspended pending a full investigation, but what punishment could he face beyond this? Well, he's been suspended from all team duties, which basically means he won't be doing anything until the conclusion of the investigation. With the next four race weekends in Formula 2 all taking Taking place in July, we can assume it means he's likely to miss races in Britain, Australia, France and Hungary, as he will not be representing his high-tech Grand Prix team. With the summer break coming up after that, Red Bull and High Tech might look to make a permanent decision on his future during that period. In the past, Vips has tested for the Red Bull Formula 1 team, and with a busy schedule of four races in July coming up, they may have seen it as an opportunity to put him in the cockpit of the car. However, he won't be near the cockpit of an F1 car anytime soon. As for his aspirations of racing in the pinnacle of motorsport, well, he might just have blown any chance he had. Red Bull Racing have no shortage of drivers in their academy, and they're all vying for a very limited number of spaces at Alpha Tower and Red Bull. If Red Bull do opt to remove him from their program, who's going to want to take a risk on him? If we take the way the world came together against Nikita Mazepin's actions in 2020, Red Bull, or whichever team ha him, could face a similar reaction, albeit under very different circumstances. So who would want that? And it's not as if Vips has already got an F1 seat. With all the hard work Formula 1 are doing to make the sport a more inclusive and equal place through the We Race As One campaign, as well as other programs the sport are involved in, it could threaten to undermine the work they're doing if Vips was to get a seat in Formula 1. Red Bull have plenty of drivers on their roster, so Yuri Vips may have just blown his chance at racing in the top tier of motorsport. Don't forget, if you're new around here, you can subscribe so you never miss a video. And if you like what you see, hit the like button. It really does help. That's all from me. I'll catch you next time.